The Russian Defense Ministry has announced that it signed a contract for the delivery of a batch of Kinzhal hypersonic nuclear capable air launched ballistic missiles with the KB Machinostroenia. A state contract for the production and delivery of Kinzhal missiles was signed at the International Defense Forum Army 2021, the Russian Defense Ministry told the reporters. Earlier, as Eurasian Times reported, Russia is developing the latest KH-95 long-range hypersonic airborne missile for its armed forces. The Russian military believes to have dominance in airspace and outer space is vital to maintain an edge over adversaries. It's for this purpose that such new and modernized models of weapons, military and special equipment such as the Tu-160M strategic missile carrier bomber, the Kinzhal hypersonic airborne missile system, high-precision long-range airborne weapons, in particular the KH-95 hypersonic missile, are being developed and introduced into the service for the Russian airspace forces, Colonel General Vladimir Zornitskyt wrote in an article. Russian Defense Minister Sergei Shoigu said back in fab that hypersonic weapons would be the main component of country's conventional deterrence forces. There are also reports that Russia's fifth-generation Su-57 fighters may be equipped with the prospective Kinzhal missiles after 2030. A representative of the Russian Aerospace Forces told the President Vladimir Putin, according to Sputnik News Agency, there are plans to equip the Su-57 fighter jet with an advanced Okhotny combat drone. The representative recalled in his conversation with Putin at an exhibition in the National Defense Management Center. Earlier, two MIG-31K aircraft loaded with carrying Kinzhal hypersonic missiles were deployed to Syria for the first time as part of joint military drills. The Russian Defense Ministry had stated, a pair of MIG-31K aircraft which are able to use the Novest Kinzhal hypersonic missiles flew for the exercise to Russian's Kimamium Air Base in the Syrian Arab Republic, the statement said. The aircraft will carry out learning tasks in Syria, one of the graves said.